I'll be honest with that. She was one of my really close friends in elementary school and throughout high school. So, you know, we're, we're pretty close. So she has the a quad that I've been talking about in my last photo Monday, and we finally went for a ride. So I show her my little wheelie that I've been practicing, and she's like, oh, my God. And I'm like, yeah. So we go to the spot where we go off-roading. No, we're having fun. I was saying to her that I want to go in the woods because I don't really like the sand pits just because the bike is a little uneasy. Hello, motorcyclist. You want to follow me? Shit, we just went in a circle. Yeah, we did. You didn't know that? <laughs> that was clearly a circle too. Wow. So we go back to the sand pit just because. You know, we don't want to be in the woods where the there's a lot of people that live and you know I didn't notice but she saw people in the pool on one of the houses that we have. So you know, we didn't want to get a cop called on us, so we went back. Back to the sand pit and you know I was practicing, I was going to circles, just because, you know, it's fun. So I asked her, I was like, Yaka, do you think I can ride the quads, you know, around a little? And she's like, oh yeah. Can I ride it? Yeah, <laughs> So I rode the quad. It's a little different than the pit bike. As you can see, like I literally got on and I went to like, you know, do the throttle. Oh. I went like this. <laughs> <laughs> and I forgot that it's like a thumb thing. So like you see like spotting around. Quite fun. Then we went to go out and I was like, hey, I wanna go to the beach to see the water. You you can totally hear me saying that here. Let's go to the the, the bay. Yeah, let me get my helmet on. Protection that you do not have. She's like, okay, so we started to go, and when we crossed the street, I stalled out because my bike was being weird. I was playing with the engine, trying to tighten all the bolts because it's leaking oil. So I think I messed with one of the idler screws. I don't know, but I'll fix that. So I told her, hey, y'all can cross the street. I'll be there in just a second. So, because I didn't want her to get in trouble, because, you know, it's a quad. So, she went across the street, and, you know, that was fine. So, I went to cross the street, and I noticed that she was stopped. And I was like, what do you, I mean, I know she was probably waiting for me, but, you know, you can idle like that. She started pointing, I think, at her quad, and she's like, my, my chain must have popped off. So... I went to look, but I also saw in front of me the chain was on the ground. So, I think I picked up the chain for her, she picked it up, I forgot. Oh. Yo, what the fuck? Yo. What the fuck? I think you can put it back on. How do you... Okay, we can make... We, uh. we, can, we can rig it. We looked at the chain and it's completely in one piece, except that one of the links, I guess, fell off, so we thought, hey, why don't we just try to put it back on, and then we'll go home, and we'll, like, get this resolved. So, so I'm a mini mechanic. That's gonna be, like, impossible to go through there. Right? So, I'm sorry. Oh, I got it. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, yeah, I did. So, you see us here putting it on, and, you know, it was fine, so we linked it, and it went on. I think she rode maybe, you know, you see she rode like five, ten feet.
were like, all right, we got to tow this thing back. So I would say... You want me? <laughs> I was saying, you gotta wait here. I'm gonna go get the towing cables so we can tow you back. I got the towing cables. I put them on the back of my pity onto the frame. And then I went to tie it onto her quad so we can tow it back. I got it all hooked up, and I was like, all right, let's go. So she said, make sure to keep tension. Uh, you can hear it. She said, make sure to keep tension onto the cord when we pull her. Just keep on the gas. Back. She didn't feel like I was pulling her. And I looked back and I was, we were going. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is, this is working. So I kept riding. And then we got to this one point where we turned on the road. And the big dead with a big blind spot. And I saw there was a car behind us. So I stayed on the right side of the road. You're good. <clears throat> okay, we're good. Go quick after this car. Good. When I pulled her turning, I didn't realize that you yanked your bike. So I had some trouble, trouble right here. back but a fast forward when we got onto her house um she parked her car in the garage so i went to put it full into the garage and then it went perfectly fucking perfect <laughs> you can see Damn. she was like perfect because like look it's like right where it was supposed to be is what happened to my hip bike the i just had to zip tie the license plate back on but Nothing too major. No. Nope. Alright, so this is going to conclude the end of Moto Monday, number two. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to check out my previous Moto Monday. I'll put a video link right here. Also, subscribe. I just hit 50 subscribers, and my goal is 100 subscribers. So you can just hit that subscribe button. I post videos two times a week one on Mondays, one on Fridays. Mondays are Moto Mondays, and Fridays are a random video that I will make. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Please leave a like so I know I'm doing good and I got quality content. Also leave a comment saying what I should change or if you like what I have, what I've created.